We're uh, at the National Gallery of Art, and we're looking at Glenn Perry's beautiful painting of the uh, Janus Museum's uh, historic cottage. And uh, Glenn, could you tell us a little bit about the painting? You made a few changes in I the... I uh, make a few changes. I guess this is the East Wing of the Janus Museum. I think so. I can never remember which is which. I think it's the East Wing. Anyway, there are... Beautiful painting. There are several signature objects that are no longer... That, well, they, I found them to be a little bit of clutter. So there's a... Uh, there's a bolt head, uh, which is a, uh, the namesake of uh, Janus. Mm -hmm. uh, it would normally be seen... Uh, That's to right. the left of the staircase. Black fiberglass um, uh, bull or steer's head. Yes, yeah, hanging on the uh, the oil uh, yeah, tanks. Uh, uh -huh. Yeah, it's right, uh, yeah. right there. Yeah. And also, well, there's a nice uh, aerial, uh, oil bomb, an aerial bomb. Oh, right, bomb. the bomb on the back porch. The, uh, on the back porch in front of the window. Mm -hmm. the That's the welcome bomb, yeah. So you took those out, that's uh, artistic license? Artistic license, uh, yes, to simplify the composition, uh -huh. uh, although it did rob it of some of its character. No, no, not at all. necessary for mm -hmm. uh, clarity. Bomb is up there usually, I think. Yeah. 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 No, it looks, it looks great without. Maybe we should think about the... Uh, the, uh, the gas grill's not there either. Oh, the grill, uh, right. I don't know if that is a... But that's probably not... That doesn't go back to the days of... Uh, no, it's not a historic grill, I don't think. Grill. No, it's uh, fairly contemporary. And, and no cats either, right? There are no cats, which is yeah. actually very significant. Uh -huh. There would be two or three. At least two. Hundreds of them. Hundreds. Yeah. And uh, the other facet of this, interesting facet of this painting is that it captures uh, a historic moment in the, uh, the neighboring cottage, which oh. uh, no longer uh, has, it, it's, un, uh, it's undergone some renovations. Uh, That's uh, Bittersweet Cottage, yes, formerly the, uh, the Pacer Farm. Yes. We're still the Pacer Farm. Yes. Yeah. Anyway, so he's, uh, he's done some things there that have changed mm -hmm. the look of it quite a bit. So it's already changed quite a bit from the way you, uh, yeah. you show it here. Yeah. That's fascinating. It's uh, a glimpse in uh, the past of uh, Washington Grove. That's great. A very popular painting spot. We have found yes. uh, in the last season there are at least three people who painted a similar uh, vantage uh, huh. of the house. With, uh, well, we really should charge people for the uh, opportunity. Yeah. Right. We'll give you a, 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 a fly on it because uh, you're a local artist. But these these outside people really ought to pay for it through right. the nose. Well, well but although I'm bringing a large group by in the next two weeks. Uh, oh. What is it? So Sunday, the 28th or 9th of April. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, Washington Society of Landscape Painters will be painting the town. Oh, that'll be and interesting. I imagine that somebody will find themselves parked behind the historic cottage. Well, if so, we'll have someone from our uh, plan giving uh, office out there with uh, hat in hand to uh, try to get some generous contributions. Glenn, thank you very much. It's a beautiful painting, and thank you very much for uh, bringing us down to, uh, to see it here at the, uh, the National Gallery of Art.